your clone. How's it going, Clone Club? Welcome back. I'm Dusty Mac, and thank you for joining me on this Orphan Black reaction series. Today, we are continuing with more Orphan Black. This one is Season 4, Episode 5, Human Raw Material. And, uh, I don't know that little girl's name. I keep thinking, thinking like, Rebecca, but that doesn't sound right. But then the only other little girl's name that I know is Kira. <laughs> and obviously, she's no Kira. I'll get her name eventually, unless she just dies and then doesn't really matter because uh to rachel basically she is human raw material she is just there to be studied as she slowly dies from this disease that they could prolong to hopefully cure but they want to study it oh pen <laughs> but they want to study the disease's progression so they can help themselves basically at the expense of this little girl and that's uh it's pretty reprehensible rachel so um rachel's still doing shitty rachel things and you know the last episode, like, when I was watching, I was just thinking to myself, like, you know, I kind of feel bad for her, you know, her eye thing, and just, she's in a wheelchair, she's, I feel good she's starting to get, like, her personality back and her speeches and stuff, but then she does something like that, and I'm like, you know what, fuck you, Rachel. <laughs> so yeah, it's like midnight right now, and I really just want to jump into this episode, so uh, if you like this reaction, please make sure you hit that like button for the algorithm, and subscribe, and hit that little bell in the corner, because it'll tell you when my next video comes out, which is usually every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday, and I also do some bonus videos and stream hardly ever. And if you guys want to support the channel financially, the Patreon and everything else is down below, and I guess without any further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into this Orphan Black episode. This one is Season 4, Episode 5, Human Raw Materials. Let's do it. Oh, crystals. What are you doing with all this ass, Crystal? Double cheeked up on a Thursday. Um, I was saying something, but respectfully, I completely forgot everything about everything. So I've been doing all this internet research and I've discovered that Dyad, Hector, and the twins, they're all connected. Welcome back to the fold, Crystal. Like, she's... I'm training, like I'm on a mission. Okay, I'm gonna be ready. I uh. Uh. <laughs> I might have a new favorite clone. <laughs> Woo! I gotta vibe out. <laughs> Let's go. That, uh, that was my favorite scene of the entire series so far. <laughs> but it looks like she's uh, starting to learn to defend herself, and that's pretty badass. Is this like Uncle Felix's mural? I like this much, but... <laughs> <laughs> but... You don't need to put your ass out to do it. <laughs> Although, Sarah, if you want to do that, you know, I'm, feel free. Art, you know. You have to go. Nothing's getting in the way! <laughs> oh, we're having fun day together! Gene connection. That's the company Felix used to find his bio sister. Probably just a coincidence. Uh, nothing is ever a coincidence in this show. The exclusive Brightborn orientation is today. I know, that's why I'm trying to get Sarah to hustle her way in with Donnie, but I have to cancel my committee meeting on new math. It's new math. <laughs> it's an old Bull Burnham song. I know the science. I'll go. Okay, Donnie will pick you up. Ready for Brightborn orientation. Kasima is now Looking carrying sharp. child, Donnie. Um, so wait. You don't want to know what I had to do to research the gay role. Oh my god. <laughs> Donnie, the baby's fake. It doesn't matter. Peter Patter. Let's get at her. Poor Donnie. It, it matters. You're an actress. <laughs> you know what it entails to really take in the character? Uncle Felix! Did you paint all of this? I did. Is that a rocket ship? You can yes. call it that. That's exactly what they do. <laughs> the way you found Adele. It's connected to me and Lucian. You're still on this. I don't understand. Yeah, I've realized it's a... Felix has to know that it's a threat still. Felix is real sister. How? Uh, we have the same father. You know what? It's a long story. Families are confusing. You can't come in and just change my character. Isn't he gonna recognize I'm gay, Donnie? But I'm not like super gay. Maybe don't play the lesbian angle too much. I'm just gonna let that one slide. <laughs> <laughs> I guess it still works because that's like the surrogate they found, right? I do kind of like that drip though. I'm not gonna lie. I have zero style. I just wear like an overshirt, like a button-up shirt. This is our surrogate Ava Jackajetsky. Jackabowski. <laughs> Jack? Did you say Jackajetsky? We'll start with our non-disclosure agreements. You picked a good weekend. Evie Cho is here. Seriously? Oh, she's gonna recognize Kasima. I can do a sibling DNA test. Oh, 
us. Where's Casino? Nobody's looking for Helena right now, and that kind of makes me upset. I'm trying to figure out if Felix is by his sister's real or not. Get me hair or saliva samples. And Cosima went undercover in the Brightborn. She's a high-level Neo. Won't you know what a clone looks like? Good point, Donnie. This is your first Brightborn, baby. My son, Georgie, is two now. He is just perfect. I was going to say, it's going to be that. Remember that little kid that used to be a bodybuilder? <laughs> just completely jacked. My parents rolled their genetic dice. My immune system was severely compromised, a condition known as SCID. Doctors told us... This was my life. Did she always have that scar? I didn't notice it last time. I entered an experimental gene therapy trial. By the time I graduated, I was in full remission. All right. How are you going to get this All sample? Right. So, second position? I guess Felix is as easy enough, but... Mm. I went to go live in Iceland as my granny. Uh, Kira, we gotta go. I guess that was super easy. Barely an inconvenience. Bye. Felix knew that she was on a mission there. I don't know if he knew what she was doing, but he knew something was up. More crystal? Please, more crystal. Always more oh crystal. Oh, no. She picked the wrong fucking time to go. Legitimately sending my life away here. It's a lot of paperwork. She's going to recognize her, though. I'm just kidding. Willing to make that sacrifice? Yeah. <laughs> oh, no. I think your runaway clone is here. I saw her conning her way into orientation. So they got two clones right where they really shouldn't be. No jaundice, no colic. Wanting a baby is, is a natural urge. Not just an urge, it's an imperative. Would you like to hold him? Hello, my name is Jared. <laughs> he just like speaks perfect English and has a nice firm handshake. Wow, these bright warm oh babies God, are- he's so cute. Look at him and his little dimples. Look at him. So yeah, where do you look there, Donnie? <laughs> I have to go. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> I guess you know it's going to be the bookend of this episode. Damn, I wish Cosima wouldn't have left. But... The other floors are off limits. Thanks. You know who this is? Allison Hendricks. She looks like Beth. I don't see it. Thank you. Maintain that position. I, you know, all you white people look alike. <laughs> if that offended you, I'm sorry. I know that's a racier joke these days. Being that it was a race joke. <laughs> it's okay, I'm white. They sold the drugs. Through a soap store. How do they figure that out? Well, what goes on in the suburbs never ceases to surprise. One cop to another. Focus on your real family. Let Beth go. He knows that he's working with them for sure. What the hell are the Hendrixes up to? Tuco just warned me to stay clear of them. He said they're dealing pills. What? But well, you don't know anything about this. Come on, no. You're on your own on this one. They're out though now, right? Because they killed... Oh, Helena killed that one dude. Pouchy. Please tell me you're not drug dealers. We dabbled briefly in prescription pharmaceuticals, but that's all done now. As I recall, when we met, you were trying to offload a kilo of cocaine. <laughs> Art's job is on the line here. Okay, but what do the cops know? Did I mention Helena? What about Helena? Helena's gone. She's left. Left? There's camping gear missing. Look, I'm not your prego sister's keeper. You are so self-righteous, you know that? Hello? Bitch. <laughs> Bitch. <laughs> They're all sisters. Is this seat taken? That's Duncan, right? Professor Duncan? Ava. For some reason, it looked like Cosima has uh, an Umbrella Academy tattoo on her wrist. What kind of research? Oh. oh. <clears throat> Thanks, really? Susan knows. Perhaps babies with dimples are more likely to be photographed. <laughs> what, what about one dimple? Is that okay? <laughs> We have been very successful at eliminating certain genetic risk factors, altering the DNA of an embryo. You're letting on that you know a lot more than you're supposed to. Oh, hey, a pumpkin. <laughs> Thanks for the invitation. I thought we were taking this whole new family thing slow, Fee. Matt? Stop. Okay, okay. In front of her, though? Like, you shouldn't let on anything until you know for sure. I get it, she's probably very... They always do this. <laughs> Kira's the most grown up out of all of them, but they always fight like this. And... There you are. Jesus Christ! Sorry, sorry. <laughs> Dude, I've got a key card. I'm Great. going up to Listen the lab. Listen to me. There's another clone here. Big blonde hair, voice like a can opener. <laughs> Crystal 
Connorish? What? Why is she a breakboard? I don't know. She doesn't even know she's a clone. Dude, she's gonna screw this all up. Get rid of her, okay? Wait, does she know more than... How? Susan might have let her steal that card, so she might be walking into a trap. The two of you, you're bloody paranoid. Kira's here. We have a right to be suspicious no. of Adele. She's my sister. I guess we'll find out. What the hell is that supposed to mean? I sampled you both. Scott's doing a DNA test. You poached our DNA. It's a little invasive, Sarah, but obviously it's all right. Pretty little thing with the sundress on. Look at some damn right show wrong. Let me win around my own little song of you. <laughs> I was looking to get a massage. I'm just like very tight back here, so. I mean, you're basically looking at your wife, man, but not Rami. exactly your wife. I will be in there. <laughs> Doing it for the good of everybody, so just keep her keep her occupied. Have we forgotten what happened the last time a perceptive clone came poking around my side of things? Bring her in. Are you decent? Mm -hmm. Damn. <laughs> Comfortable? Damn. I'm actually in the healing arts too. A doctor or? No, I'm a beautician. Help people reveal their true beauty. Just like a doctor. Can I trust you? She is not a good spy. My person. <sighs> I'm on a professional investigation right now. <clears throat> I truly believe they're conducting human experiments. You're just talking to like some random guy in Brayborn though, Crystal. I'm being personally targeted because I'm a whistleblower. And if that French blonde doctor hadn't saved me, I would be like physically dead right now. You mean Dr. Cormier? <laughs> How do you know that name? I'm actually here to help you, Crystal. How do you know my name? <laughs> oh! oh. 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 Favorite clone. Favorite clone. Favorite clone. <laughs> Sorry, Kasima, you're a very close second, but Crystal. Crystal, Crystal, Crystal. Crystal staying all the way. Oh my god, I'm sorry. Come with me, please. <laughs> yeah, it's not gonna work against somebody that knows what they're doing. At least they got the wrong clone, though, because she's still pretty in the dark about everything. She's piecing things together. What if. What if what if Crystal's like the hero at the end of season five? Like she pieces everything together and she's able to like save the day or something. I don't know. This isn't fair. I didn't do, I didn't do anything. Fine. I stole these, okay? <laughs> what is it? <laughs> stole a lot of stuff. But you know, free samples, right? That's Crystal Godric. I'll speak with security. Get them to track down the right leader. I just came here to have like a baby. <laughs> Oh, Crystal. Best clone. <laughs> Are Brayborn babies just too big or something? And they're, do they have difficult births? It's kind of weird, right? Me just popping up out of the blue. Just a little uh, unexpected. Convenient. Plus, I'm a total disaster. <laughs> Ever since my daddy died. Sob story to ingratiate yourself. So is it expensive gene connection? I hope for Felix's sake that it is his sister. Spit in a cup, mail it off. I don't know that everyone's comfortable coughing up their genetic profile to a corporation. Yeah, everyone is. I did it. <laughs> Back to your room, go on, get- They're all pregnant women. We're supposed to be done by now. You know you can't leave. You'll be disqualified from the study. <laughs> Let's see if Kira trusts her. That's the, that's the big test right there. So why gene connection? Just again. Well, there's a lot of other companies that do it. Maybe the, the commercials. Gene connection. Your family finders. I was expecting a Republican with big hair. <laughs> What's a Republican? Let's not give you that. <laughs> I was just going to say basically the same thing, but pretty much. Are you an asshole or is it just that thing in your face? Again, if you had that in your face, like, wouldn't you be a little on edge? I love my new brother. I just don't believe that. I should just go. No, you know what? I think you should stay. Maybe you should go. Hmm? Felix! What did you do? <laughs> They're real brother and sister, not this chick. Sorry, adult. I had you and Felix genetically tested. And I thought we already did that. She's my sister, isn't she? Yeah, 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 she is. I mean, you have to feel good for Felix, but I mean, Sarah just ate a lot of crow right there, and she, she, I guess she didn't apologize, but she's kind of, feels like she's losing her brother. Welcome to the family. Shit, sorry. Thank you. Yeah, get used to it. I don't trust her. I still think she's part of some faction. We've got a carrier fully dilated. Give me a hand. Oh god, I want to push. Not yet. Oh. Let's get her onto her side. <sighs> it's okay. You're gonna hear from my lawyer about this. You are more than welcome to. Oh. Oh. I have Every seen that thing okay. before. Uh, yeah, she got like assaulted by those other two, Rudy and. Slide down the bed for me. Oh. 
<laughs> Just what she was looking for. That's gonna be the end. That's gonna be the end. That's the end. It's not the end. All right. Yes. It's gotta be soon though, at least. These are human beings Crates. that you're tinkering Mutant with. Monster pig babies. Trial and error without consent. Terriers are very well compensated. How can you even support this? You don't even know the long-term effects. Look at me. I'm sick. I never gave permission for any of this. I created you to unlock the mysteries of the human genome. We're not giving you candles so you can make more lab rats. You're dying. You don't have the resources to save yourself, but share. The original's genome? Together, we can make a cure. It's a great pitch, but how can you trust her? I know how they feel sometimes. Cosima, when she's sad. Helena, when she's lonely. Rachel's the angriest. <laughs> There's even some I don't know. I didn't understand. Those aren't dreams. What are they? I don't know, Mikey. Is she having premonitions or something? I feel you too, Mommy. I wonder what Kira is capable of and what she's able to do and why. It's up to them now. We are as close to the original as we have ever been. I'm just saying. <laughs> My love. Get it, Gaster? <laughs> she's a gilf. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so that's where it stops. Sure. Alright, everybody, that was Orphan Black Season 4, Episode 5, Human Raw Material. And, um,. That was a lot of stress. Just for one, having Allison in there with Brayborn and Topside and Neolution. Basically, all those people are kind of there. And then you had another clone, Crystal, which, uh, triumphant return for my favorite clone, Crystal. But yeah, she ended up coming there, and uh, obviously there was some clone swappage with them trying to go after Allison and them grabbing Crystal. And again, she doesn't know what's going on, but she's just kind of being thrown in the middle of it and kind of having to be, like, apologized to him. Like, oh yeah, sorry about that off on your way like she's gonna start piecing more and more of it together as we see that she's at the main place that she needs to be but then of course you know sarah and felix were kind of butting heads as sarah didn't trust that uh felix's official new sister uh was actually a sister which i'm glad for felix's sake that he does have some family bonds now but i, I do feel that like sarah feels like he's slipping away from her and uh i can obviously see how she would be upset by that but then at the end you know kira had that little thing she said to her mom like i can feel them and i can feel more so can she track other clones is that i don't i don't know what that could be used for how that came about naturally it's just interesting uh so anyway guys what did you think of this episode and what do you think about felix's new sister were you happy for felix do you feel like it's kind of like a a tacked on addition uh obviously i'm sure she's gonna have some kind of stake in the overall plot eventually and uh, i can't wait to find out what that is because i'm gonna watch some more orphan black tomorrow uh so yeah let me know what you thought about that in the comment box down below and if you like this reaction please make sure you hit that like button for the algorithm and subscribe and hit that little bell in the corner because it'll tell you when my next video comes out usually every monday wednesday and friday and i also do some bonus videos and stream hardly ever and if you guys want to support the channel financially the patreon and everything else is down below and with the patreon you're going to get these full length reactions over there week or weeks before the youtube audience so if that interests you go check that out if not it'll be on the youtubes eventually uh so yeah that's going to be about it for me for the night so thank you so very much for joining me you know i love and appreciate every single one of you and remember if you're going to go outside be safe wear that mask don't be an and I will see you all next week for some more Orphan Black. Take it easy, guys. I have to go. Shit. <laughs>